I bought four of these linear actuators. Uh, these are 12 volt, 150 kilo maximum load, and um, well, it's uh, they, these are short ones, only 50 millimeter uh, stroke, but that's uh, just about what I need for my CNC. I will build some wheels um, so that I can lift the CNC and move around easily if I want to. The box came with uh, two fixtures, one for each end of the linear actuator. And just in case you don't know what the linear actuator is, it's, it's a, a fairly simple device. It contains a DC motor, a gearbox and a rod which is uh, driven in and out by a screw mechanism inside this. And as I said earlier, it's a 12 volt device. So connecting 12 volts, to, 12 volt to, to these wires should result in moving in or out. Now it doesn't matter if you connect plus to to the red or to the black, it depends uh, on how it's wired inside. And uh, there are also two uh, limit switches, so if like in this case the rod is at its minimum then the limit switch at the, this end is triggered so the device will not move. Okay so now I switched on the power supply and as you can see it is not moving. Now if I connect black to the red, I mean the negative of my power supply to the red and the positive to the black, then as you can see it's moving slowly out. And when it arrives to the and it will stop because of the end switch. To move it back again, just connecting the, the plus to the red and the minus to the black. And it's pulling back. And actually it is it is really very very strong so it will work fine my CNC weights about 120 kilo so each one of these can lift 150 which is more than enough I will have one installed on each uh, feet of my each foot of my my CNC And what I will do actually is simply removing this and I will drill a hole inside there. 
in this one. And I will screw this uh, wheel one in each of the rod, and that will be like uh, inside there. And when it will be pushed out by the linear actuator, it will lift my CNC. So that's it for now. I will show you once I'm ready. I will show you how it looks like on the CNC. Thank you for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe.